थैंक यू भाजोक न्यूज फॉर हैविंग मी एक्चुअली ऑल दिस सिनारियो इज जस्ट हैपनिंग एज द नॉर्मलाइजेशन एफर्ट्स बिटवीन सऊदी अरबिया एंड इसराइल ऑन गोइंग एंड अंडर वे एंड नंबर ऑफ द डिप्लोमेटिक एक्सचेंजेस हैपेंड सो द सिनारियो दैट इज डिवेल्प फ्राम गाजा टू इसराइल बिटवीन फ्राइडे एंड सैटरडे दैट इज वेरी अनयूजल प्रटी अनयूजल फ्राम लास्ट फिफ्टी ईयर्स एट मोस्ट बिकॉज एज यू ऑब्जर्व द वे द हमास इन्फिल्ट्रेटर्स इन्वेडेड इन इसराइल दैट इज टोटली अनयूजल दे यूज थ्री वेज दैट इज सी एरियल एंड द लैंड बॉर्डर एंड नाउ वट विजल्स वी आर रिसीविंग फ्राम गजा दे आर आर बिल्डोजर्स फ्राम हमास पीपल दे आर दे हैव बिल्डोजर्स दे हैव पैरा ट्रूपर्स एंड नाउ वट वी लर्न दैट दे आल्सो इन्वेडेड थ्रू द सी एरिया सो एट लीस्ट टू थाउजेंड रॉकेट्स दैट इज नॉट कन्फर्म फिगर दैट इज दैट वी आर एक्सपेक्टिंग एंड वी हैव मल्टीपल सोर्स एंड वी लर्न दैट दे आर अबाउट फाइव थाउजेंड मिजल्स अटैक्स फ्राम हमास टू इसराइल एंड दैट लैड एट मोस्ट नाइन हंड्रेड नाइन हंड्रेड इंजर्ड एंड मोर दैन सेवेंटी पीपल डेड इन इसराइल एंड आलमोस्ट टू हंड्रेड प्लस डेड इन पैलेस्टाइन सो नाउ द सिनारियो इज दैट एवरी वन इज डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द दिस इज एक्सट्रीम रिटेलिएशन रिएक्शन बिकॉज इसराइली प्राइम मिनिस्टर बेंजामिन नितिन याहू वेन ही टुक पोडियम इन यूनाइटेड नेशन जनरल हेडकोर्टर्स ही शोड अ मैप इन इज हैंड एंड सेड दिस इज न्यू मिडल ईस्ट एंड इन दैट मैप देर इज नो पैलेस्टाइन and is saudi arabia uae and israel that, that that were clearly visible there to so now this is basically uh, the point is uh, basically what was happening before uh, very parallel to this development that was israeli saudi normalization efforts and with these uh, attempts with this action that that uh, that was not expected even like this uh, intensity Uh, now uh, everyone is talking about that there are uh, a very bad impacts on the normalization and peace efforts between israel and saudi arabia but the thing is israel has declared war uh, with gaza with hamas people and now they are conducting air raids as uh, i am talking with you at this time still uh, we have information that hamas people are in the israeli cities and uh, the most severe thing is that they took hostages from israeli military and uh, Uh, taken back to the gaza so now what happened what uh, happened in the past what we observed is that uh, number of um, events happened when uh, gaza people like hamas uh, took hostages of israeli people and they got demands uh, against their uh, freedom and after that some uh, mediator will come and mediate and uh, then both parties will release uh, their uh, Uh, prisoners like israeli soldiers in hamas uh, captive and uh, the hamas uh, prisoners in uh, israeli prisoner uh, prisons so uh, this is the thing that uh, main thing hamas is doing and now uh, what important is united states state department uh, very clearly mentioned that we are closely observing and uh, president biden uh, we himself called uh, benjamin netanyahu and uh, express his sympathies we also observed the uh, statement by the saudi ministry of foreign affairs pakistan ministry of foreign affairs and uh, turkey specifically all three countries are uh, just repeating the two state solution and having a very neutral uh, neutral uh, take on this matter but the saudi arabia is somehow different at this time because it is in talks they are in talks with the israel so uh, they condemned literally this uh, incident but the other countries are still uh, in the confusion uh, whether they condemn or not but this is uh, actually the scenario that, that is just developed so uh, yes the upcoming hours are very important as uh, we can uh, uh, we are expecting big retaliation from israeli and uh, we are observing that the number of air raids conducted by israelis and the rights activists said they most of the residential buildings are being uh, targeted uh, by the israelis but uh, israeli military israeli government they have very clear stance that uh, at this time we are at war and number of casualties we have 
or infrastructure have been uh, got written by the uh, Gaza uh, Hamas so that that's why we will retaliate with the severe response